And yes, indeed, I am live right now. Thank you all for tuning in to Encore number 163. I didn't put my glasses on, but yes, 163. Our weekly series continues well into the hundreds, uh, but every single time it is unique. And this time around, we're going to be, there's a lot of players that we've seen before, but um, yeah, because of the school year, a lot of, you know, the, a couple of the people that we normally expect as regulars aren't here, which gives other people who maybe sit on the periphery more a chance to step up tonight, maybe find themselves in top eight for the first time ever. And both these players, depending on their run, they've been in the scene for a while. They might be able to do it. Of course, this is Infernape versus VB3, the Pac-Man. Now, this matchup in and of itself, uh, if Sinji was here on the mic, he would talk your ear off. Uh, there are so many complex things that go on in this matchup, and I regret to inform you, I don't know them. <laughs> so you and I will get to learn together as we watch how Banana interacts with all Pac-Man's kooky stuff. Oh yeah, but <laughs> like, funnily enough, is Banana a better fruit than bonus fruit? I mean, if you're holding Banana, at the very least, it also denies Diddy Kong his Banana. Uh, but, I mean, Bell is almost a is it a better banana? I guess they each have their own situational advantages, so it's hard to claim that one is just superior over the other. Because banana can still do that. What a good out of shield option as long as he's holding it. Takes the stock, and that means that we're looking at right now a two stock to one lead for Infernape. And the thing is that because he's Diddy Kong, being up a stock means he can get a massive percentage advantage. Or he's just gonna die. Okay. Getting tossed all around and finds himself in the actual hydrant by the end of it. Although Infernape, that stock lead, uh, even though it was brief, seems to have given him the chance to gain a little bit of a percent advantage. But uh, Diddy Kong is a character that can sometimes struggle to find kills. Pac-Man definitely can struggle for that him, uh, himself. But if you get caught in a nasty setup, oh, I've seen people die disgustingly early against this rotund man. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, it's a cheeky setup uh, where you can throw the bell at the hydrant and then the water pushes it at supersonic speeds. All right. Oh, I think he was trying to use some uh, momentum stuff with the hydrant to uh, maybe find an opening where I... Oh, what was that? No, that was the game right there. <gasps> that was also the game right there. Oh, my God. Are we actually going to see the spaghetti? Infernape was dead two times over, and now VB3 is sitting at 110%. Infernape's still alive, 144. So much Pac-Man has, can kill, but he has to actually find it. Another back air from that deep on stage. It's not actually gonna take it, but oh, the apple, it came. You saw it coming. Oh, what a bad time to pull banana. Yeah, this is something when you're playing against Pac-Man, a, be conscious of what fruit is on deck, because that will totally change the way he's going to use it. And also, B, just pay attention and react. Uh, 